Hello, Hans and Magnus. I'm so happy to be under this roof, this beautiful, magnificent roof with all of you. And the energy in here is most palpable. And we're here to fix everything. And there's some young people in the room. And it's up to you guys to fix all the problems that we caused. But we can help you. We can help you. We plan to do it. Um, I'm here with fellow UN Foundation board members, uh, distinguished guests, my family, uh, and so many of you are friends. And you know how important the UN is to the world. We haven't blown ourselves up yet. We've avoided World War III, and that's because of the work of the UN. We have diplomats from every region, UN leaders, great friends and champions, from civil society, business, and philanthropy. You all know the current state everywhere, and it's depressing. And why it matters so much that we have a UN that's strong and vibrant. My father, Ted Turner, couldn't be with us tonight. He's actually recovering from COVID, but he's fine. He took Paxlovid on day one, never got fever, but he sends his well wishes and gratitude for all of your hard work and uh, perseverance. And I just want to let you know that Dad is so proud of everything the UN Foundation has been able to accomplish for nearly 25 years, so 24 years. And if you know Ted, and many of you in this room do, then you know he isn't daunted by big challenges. He's really energized by them, like the ever-ready battery bunny on steroids. <laughs> he has always believed in his heart of hearts that everyone, we the peoples, is capable of great things, and they're capable of even more when everyone works together. We have a tremendous amount of work to do, as you've heard from every speaker tonight, to protect our oceans, our climate, our communities, and who? The young people that are inheriting all of these problems and blessings. And we need to get the SDGs on track. Dad often uses a sailor's term, and I've heard him use it many times, and we do have some sailors in the room. Magnus, you're one. And it's used when there's stormy weather and rocky seas on the horizon. The term is all hands on deck, right? It gives me the chills, all hands on deck. And now is that time. As a passionate and dedicated member of the UN Foundation family, I can tell you we are laser focused on what can be done to continue the support the UN at this critical time for people and planet needs. And we've heard that people and planet a few times. I feel gratitude for Dad and our ocean of partners for their unwavering commitment to the UN and the institution's ability to bring the world together. We must achieve a more equitable, healthy, livable planet. 